Minimizing surface area. The problem. Consider a cylindrical coffee cup. It is made of coated paper with no lid. If a coffee cup contains 390 milliliters or 390 centimeters cubed, determine the dimensions which have the smallest possible, the minimum surface area. The reasoning. We know that the optimal cylinder has a height that is equal to its diameter. So the formula for the volume of a cylinder changes from volume equals pi r squared h to volume equals 2 pi r cubed. Since h is 2 r and we substitute 2 r for h and then collect like terms. First, let's calculate the radius from the volume. Well, if we rework the formula, the radius is equal to the cubic root of the volume divided by 2 pi. So r is the cubic root of 390, which is our volume measure, divided by 2 pi. If we put this into our calculator, we will get the result 3.96 centimeter cubed. Therefore, the radius of the coffee cup is 3.96 centimeters. Since the height is equal to the diameter, and the diameter is twice the radius, the height would be 2 times 3.96, which is 7.92 centimeters. Now, we need to use the formula for the surface area of a cylinder. And here it is. The surface area of a cylinder is pi r squared plus 2 pi r h. Note the change to the surface area formula because there's no lid to the cup. Oh, that was tricky. So the surface area then, substituting in what we know, pi times the radius, which is 3.96 centimeter squared, plus 2 pi, 3.96 centimeter, and h we found to be 7.92 centimeter. When we calculate this, we will get the final answer for surface area of 20, sorry, 246.33 centimeter squared. Therefore, a radius of 3.96 centimeters and a height of 7.92 centimeters produces a minimum surface area of 246.33 centimeters squared. Oh, this is another important formula that we should add to our list. Take a moment and bring your list up to date.